Hey everybody, welcome back. What a, what a great weekly, what a good introduction to the Golden Pack. The Golden Pack, I need to remind myself not to record so much Super Auto Pets. Because... Then I'll end up in that same little unstable wobble I had going where I was like... I recorded nine episodes of the weekly a week, and then, like, by weekly three, I was a weekly behind what was actually happening. The videos were no longer contemporaneous. Let me be a Danish celebrity like um, Mads Mikkelsen. I think it's, like, the fourth time I've made that joke. It's not really a joke. He is a Danish celebrity. And also my papa. Look at that. Round one and two. I don't even sweat it, and I know it. maybe that sounds like a little... I think I do it like that. I know it sounds a little like maybe full of myself, but how, how could I sweat it when we just were sticking to the principles? I, I can sweat other rounds. I don't need to sweat round one and two. Round one and two, we've proven that we know what we're doing at least. I'm happy to take my trophies and then, you know, squander them trying to make like a magpie gazelle build work. Okay, so we got gazelles. Where's my magpie? I'm gonna go a little crazy. I'm gonna sell you. I'm gonna sell you. I am gonna buy a gazelle, and then I'm gonna give it a croissant. I'm gonna roll. I was kinda hoping to see a magpie, because the problem is our gazelle literally, like, it doesn't do anything <laughs> right now. The swan, listen, okay. Literally. We don't need the cricket to level up again. Literally, the swan will not work with our gazelle build. But is it worth just having a swan on the team? I say it won't work. Maybe it'll work eventually, but it's not going to work right away. Let's put it that way. We really, more than anything else, because if you're not familiar, maybe you're like, it will work. You need the swan to have more attack than the gazelle, so that in the shop, its ability goes before the gazelle's ability, which means that it gets the stats. But the one of our gazelles has a croissant on it and then the swan starts with one attack so it's a real uphill battle that being said that doesn't mean it's the wrong idea to take a swan because it could still give us gold and gold is always you know it's always in demand but in order to make this really functional we really do need like a, a magpie which thankfully we got this is a crazy move but i'm gonna sell a cricket I'm not going to sell a swan. I'm not going to sell a gazelle. I'm going to sell a cricket to get a magpie out here. There's no way we're ever going to catch that gazelle with the swans. So don't worry about your croissant. I'm telling you, it's just not going to happen. Now, our gazelles are also not going to be that impressive, but we do have that two extra gold that we can spend per turn. We're going to get eaten alive on this one. I know this team never works for us, but what if this time is different? What if this time is different? Still happy to have 13 gold. We care for an Okapi. We, we like a muskox in general, but I think we're going a little bit out of the pocket. We're doing something a little different here. Let's add... Let's salad real quick. It hit a swan, but not a gazelle. Okay, F it, we're balling. We're going to try... Oh, but I have no gold left for the magpie now. <laughs> We're going to try to have our swan catch up to the gazelle and maybe even pass it. I think it's worth it. would give 2-2 two -two to every gazelle every turn. That's something, man. It's something. I'm fighting for my life out here. Anyway, again, I know we've said this before. It's a little copium, but it's also a little true. Like, we're... Wait, you still got the bonus. Because you went first. Why would you go? Maybe I've been operating under false pretenses the entire time. Either way, why don't you take... Actually, we don't need two magpies. We could still take a level, though. It's going to make it harder for the swan to catch you, but now I don't even know if the swan needs to catch you. So we'd just run a second magpie. And then I think a donkey's, like, pretty good. Remember, we want to save one gold. We don't need two magpies. Yeah, I think a donkey is pretty solid. We want to save one gold. Because now our gazelle, like, getting that buff, especially with the turtle in front of them, is very important. Probably should have pilled a turtle. This is why you should always think things through. Probably should have pilled a turtle to get rid of the croissant on our gazelle, give the permanent melon armor to the gazelle, and then the swan passes the gazelle. 
Okay, so the gazelle goes first on this one. I don't know, man. Listen, I'm just... Are you crazy? I just walked over here. Don't really care for any of this. Can, maybe, but th this is a good level. This is just a great unit. I'm just thinking... Not worth, in my opinion, not worth. I'm really looking for a pill. What if, what if we... What if we said no to you, and we just tried to actually make the, the, the donkey work? You think there's a chance there? There might be. Now, Lynx is just always good. That's a given. And maybe we make the turtle level two before we pill it. it I mean, uh, uh, well, no, we don't want to pill it and lose. Well, I don't know. Maybe it doesn't matter. Listen, long story short, I'm flying by the seat of my pants. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. <laughs> and that's the way, uh-huh, uh-huh, I like it. KC and the Sunshine Band. This is a, this is a loss. No, this is a draw. We're surprisingly hanging. Give it a chance. I would. I would. It does make it harder to catch up with the swan, for sure. But it does make the magpie a lot better. So I think there's a lot to like there. We are going to get a level 2 turtle. I uh, Listen, I don't know. <laughs> I guess what I would say is we're putting a lot of faith in our gazelle right now. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That's also bad for me <laughs> I was so cocky there too oh we're close we're close okay we're having fun that's the important part okay level me dude this swan's never catching the gazelle you know it I know it is it worth pilling you yeah I think like by definition to get something else out there it is so like do it like this we do want to override the croissant I know putting it on the magpie seems like a little sus. Osprey, not really what we're looking for. A meerkat makes sense, but we'd much rather at this point have like a bird of paradise. And then, I'm, dude, maybe if we're really quick about it. <laughs> so we have to save two gold. I gotta. We're getting to the point. We should have done it a lot earlier. We're like getting to the point where a swan could do it. Or the swan could catch the gazelle. I know the order seems all sorts of scuffed up here. But we have to move the gazelle back because we don't want the melon armor to be broken by woodpeckers. And there's woodpeckers everywhere. There's also lynx everywhere. So like, you know, you, you can't really win for losing. That, this is the kind of team I was hoping to run into when I, when I took a donkey. Because we do screw them up by moving their, their turkey up. That probably made all the difference there. You're probably gone. But not for any of these. And not for any of these. Not for any of these. Probably not for any of these. Sure, for, for one of yourself, I suppose. Can, can you catch them? Can you catch the gazelle? It's a long trip. A level. A bird of paradise? Where's my bird of paradise? Four, one, two, two, five. Just seeing if... I mean, honestly... We might as well take some stats. And hey, it didn't buff a gazelle, but it buffed a swan. In theory, we're getting closer and closer. We're going to move a magpie to the front. But we're also going to move a monkey to the front. Dude, are you kidding me? Their turkey was in the perfect position. It doesn't matter. Wait, stop complaining. We got him. We got him. Not by a ton. Not, not by as much as I would have thought, but we got him. Okay, please. The swan. It's, it's getting close, man. Tiger doesn't really do much for us here. We can't put a melon on our swan. It, it's, it flies in the face of everything I, I live for. You think about... You think the time is right? Ostrich. Freeze the tier fives you get. And this guy... He, it seems bad early, but it scales real quick. I think we would stop it like right here. None of this is, like, amazing, but, you know, let's just try putting some popcorn on you, I guess. We're still three back. 
We can't catch it, man. We tried nothing. We're all out of ideas. Okay, getting the turkey out. Ooh, baby. That makes a difference. It does. Do our donkey is not doing nothing. Beautiful place. Okay, that takes us to seven. Respectable, even if it's been we've been playing a little loose. We don't want any of this. Maybe we want a grape on you. Probably should have thought of that earlier. And we, what are we looking for? Well, now you're seven ahead. I can never catch you. I can't, <laughs> I can't catch you, dude. I just want to know how to catch you. Okay, your shop is like... You're, you're literally going to gain 1-1 one, one this turn. That's horrible. I should have thought of that, I suppose. But, you know, it is what it is. It, it would be nice to get you to level two. Level two, you might scale enough to compete with the big boys. But obviously, we're not quite there yet. Now, this team, it doesn't look like we screw up their order too much. It's nice to get a two for two. Wait a minute. We might be fine on that. I, we're going to encounter some scary teams soon. We're not quite there yet, but we're going to start to encounter some, some scary teams. I'm happy. I mean, eight is just really good. I'm, I'm very content with that. I've accepted at this point we're never going to catch you, but I still like the croissant. If anything, the magpie should probably have a grape, but whatever. Do we wish to purchase another magpie? It's a lot of work to just get the gazelle one ex well three three extra per turn and three three it's not permanent unfortunately but freeze me i think we roll past it i know it's a little crazy we want to buy buffing foods but they have to have like at least some merit like i mean technically a carrot has merit and i do like the phrasing on that thank you we really want to see chocolate or buffing like stat buffing foods or chocolate Listen, I know that you know this is insane. I know this is insane. I'm rolling to see if we get chocolate. We did not get chocolate. Well, why wouldn't you buy stew then, you piece of junk? <laughs> now I'm sitting on five gold with nothing to do. So I'm just rolling three more times for more chocolate. Insanely horrendous play. Absolutely god awful play. Do not at me. We rolled 10 times. Our, no, I think it was even. Did it, was our shop 14 rolls there? Be honest with me. Did I click roll 14 times? Am I everything I, I hate? I mean, we deserve to lose. That's just obvious, but... <laughs> okay, tier fives. Chocolate me. I'm, I'm just rolling again. Where's my chocolate? Okay, a bird of paradise will go insane here. But, like, we need to live long enough to make it pop, which I'm honestly, like, pretty skeptical of. But maybe. It sucks because I had to stay. I don't know. We're okay. We're okay. Another bird of paradise. You shouldn't have. No chocolate. Freeze me. Okay. Um, I think we probably lose here. And the worst part about it by far is that we completely deserve to. Like I, I basically did nothing like the last few turns. Put something out that's good. That's not good at all. <laughs> I don't think we can win, even though it doesn't look that bad. Maybe we draw. No, we lose by because it's a mammoth. <laughs> we listen. There was definitely a ten piece in there that I threw away. I'm not gonna like lie to you on that one. But I had fun either way. Ooh, I I don't like this team. I'm not that confident in round one here. Maybe like a moist cucumber. Let me take a sip of water. I think we needed... Based on the way that I played, I think we needed to get a little luckier in the shop. Or we could have had average luck, which we probably did, and then played better. But certainly bad play plus slightly worse than above average luck. Listen, I'm trying to phrase it in the nicest way possible, okay? I really don't care for a pill bug. Like, in this situation, forget a blueberry, too. I would rather, like, roll, and if there was another 2-3, which there absolutely is, then, like, sell it out and, and start building your team on, like, the proper foundations early. And I would love to take a magpie. I, I would love to run the gazelle build back. It actually seems like it's gas in the, in the early game. Five mosquitoes is a nightmare, but we're actually gonna, we're gonna get them. 
Th maybe thanks to my 2-3 instead of having a 2-2. Two -two, I'm just going to throw that out there. You got for me. Woodpecker goes crazy. We don't need to take a magpie until we get a gazelle. Now, again, who knows? The, the ordering there might be a little twisted, but... And you know what? Let's keep the, the duck chances working here. Maybe you want to take a magpie in case you get a gazelle, but I'm going to... I think we got the... We got a sensible approach here. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. NL hates Netflix. That's... Listen, that's largely true. But I have been watching Pressure Cooker on Netflix. A new um, reality television program where good chefs cook and then inexplicably vote each other out Big Brother style. And I would give it like a 6 out of 10. I would say watchable. I would say I'm having a good time watching it. It's not must-see TV, but it's like... I've been enjoying it for, for like a, a, a head-empty watch. Sure. So we're pivoting slightly. I, I really just think a swan does fine this week. You know, extra gold is always good, but also the fact that there are like... Um, what's the word I'm looking for? There's birds of paradise in the pack. Having a level two, maybe even a level three swan by the time a bird of paradise shows up, if you're not dead by that point, it goes hard. This goes crazy hard. Links me. I need a lynx. Another woodpecker would hit the spot too. So I'm fortunate. I don't think we have anything truly incredible here. I'm going to sell you to get some free rerolls. And we knew we wanted to do it eventually. You're not my tempo. Although a meerkat is... It's maybe close enough to start thinking about it. I'm taking one more roll. Do I regret it? Yeah, I do. So I'm buying and then selling. And then taking one more roll. And I still, I still don't like it. Although now, can I tell you? This might be the, the craziest thing I've ever done. Now, our gazelle actually is going to be behind the swan, which means it's going to get a buff. It's not much of a buff. I don't think we should get too attached. We lose this one. I mean, the, they have the links that I want, but in order to get it, we need a level. We also need a woodpecker. Thank you so much. We would probably sell the duck next. Interesting. Links me? God, that would have hit the freaking spot, dude. That would have hit the freaking spot. Um, let's... I, I don't think the rooster has been 10 out of 10 this week because it's it, it takes a while until like broad buffing units show up. And the, I know you're going to say, what about a level 2 rooster? I'm telling you, level 2 woodpecker with pineapple. It's the, it's the way that nature intended for this pug to work right here. Although, wait, now that I think about it. No, 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 we still need one more pug to get. Yeah, okay, no, we're, we're doing the right thing for now. I'm, I promise you this, okay? That was a good round. Now that we have a, a, a natural level 2 woodpecker, I think we can run that. And I don't think the gazelle is going to stick around. I actually kind of liked our emu, honestly. I'm willing to sell, buy the emu, roll. I would probably buy a rooster. I'm still, that's another thing we're very interested in. I'm still looking for a lynx, almost to the extent that I was willing to, like, hold a pineapple just to try to make, like, just in case. But I think what we want to see next is we'll actually have, like, a level 3 woodpecker with a pineapple. Which is actually, like, pretty significant. Like, it's not a lynx, but it, it's really good early on. And then we can talk about, like, this emu is kind of our flex position right now. We'll take that. It's a cow. This is a tough sell. I don't know if I want to sell an emu to get a cow out there. I, I love the emu in general, but... You're going to freeze a cow, maybe, because you know at some point you're going to pivot off of it. Um, I would not sell a pug. It's kind of... I don't really want to sell a, a rooster. So we, I guess we're selling the emu. Okay, fair enough. We're going to sell the emu, which means we should... Okay, listen, we're going to lose the pineapple on this. We don't have the gold for it this turn anyway. I'm going to bet another pineapple shows up at some point in the future. So we're going to buy. We're going to sell. We're going to buy. And then I'm going to buff the rooster. I think there were a lot of different paths you could take on that one. 
And I'm still like, uh, we probably, well, once we get the pineapple on the links, we'll run level two pug into level two links. Right now, he's just happy to be here. And honestly, I'm just happy to, to have him here. I don't know if we made perfect decisions there, but I think we, we improved our team. So, you know, we don't need to worry too much about the minutia of it. God is my witness. I, I think a lynx is more important than a level two rooster. At least until the buffs start coming. Really looking for a pineapple. You should take a carrot. What am I thinking? And the, okay, well, if you're going to give me a level two rooster like that, then sure. A bird of paradise. <laughs> Okay, end my turn. The real issue here, I still think we got the order right. The real issue here is I don't know what to sell. There's a, we're kind of on like a half sniping, half stats build. That's horrendous. Um, oh, maybe it isn't. Maybe it's completely fine. Holy cow, I don't believe it. Um, but we have to sell something to fit the bird of paradise, which almost makes it like a permanent scaling team. I think you have to sell the pug and like temporarily downgrade the team to upgrade it later. Because you're not selling the swan. It works too well with the bird of paradise. The rooster works really well with the bird of paradise. The woodpecker would lose a le like a level and the lynx is already doing what it does. So I think you run it like this. And we try to get the woodpecker to level three regardless. I thank the pug for his service, by the way. Don't, don't think that I don't thank him for his service because I do thank him for his service. Thank you very much. It's, for me, I think we'll start with the Lynx. And then obviously I would love the Woodpecker to level up as well. But I, the Bird of Paradise might come second here. We'll see. I think the, the we're mainly sniping. <laughs> and the second win condition is a, a really high stat level two rooster. So I think we, we're like the Tampa Bay Lightning right now, or at least we're aspiring to be. We got multiple ways to beat you. We can put up seven goals courtesy of Kucherov, Stamkos, Point. We can shut you down defensively with Sergeyev and Victor Hedman and Vasilevsky. We can grind you out physically in a seven-game series. You know, that's, that's the way we're looking at it right now. I really think... I, I know we're on... 10 wins, essentially. I think the, the best chance of 10 wins is a level 2 bird of paradise, even though, now thankfully it did, but I was about to say even though it might not pay dividends immediately. Now, normally I might not worry about upgrading a swan, but I, I'm going to do it this time just because we're spending gold anyway, and one extra gold per turn, who knows what that could enable from a bird of paradise. Possibly nothing. It's a very scary team in and of itself here. How am I gonna get you? Am I gonna get you? I'm gonna get you! Oh, whoa. That was a, a really well played one. Hey, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, click the like button. Ooh, I put on my robe and wizard hat. Thanks for watching. If you liked it, click the like button. Helps out a great deal. Subscribe if you want to see more in the future, and I'll see you next time. See ya!